Hello, my name is Bolanle Olu Asoya. I'm a mechanical engineer by training, and I'm the CEO of Befriending Mathematics. We are taking mathematics and put, placing mathematics in its rightful position. Um, our instructional materials are unique to us. You cannot find them anywhere in the world. Unlike the wooden structures that people used to use to teach mathematics, our products are flexible. You can fold them. You can use them to teach properties. They are colorful. They have different colors to teach various uh, approaches. And you can see different uh, angles to teach the subject matter properly. Our approach is called spatalum. And spatalum means simple, practical approach to the teaching and learning of mathematics. Our products ca can be used to teach all aspects of mathematics from algebra. This is one quarter plus one quarter. This is half plus one quarter. This is half plus one third. And this is two thirds plus a quarter. So they can be used to teach algebra. They can also be used to teach three dimensional shapes. This is a cone, and this is another cone. And then they can also be used to teach statistics. So our product can actually teach algebra, it can teach geometry, it can teach statistics. And this is what mathematics covers. Hello, I am Dr. Mrs. Olatunde Comfort Akinshete. I am an advisor and coordinator to the group Befriending Mathematics. They are bringing mathematics life to students and making it easier for students to comprehend. So I stand by them all the way. I started teaching mathematics in 1962 in Ibadan here. And since then, I have been teaching mathematics and nothing else but mathematics. Mathematics is the most abused subject in the school system. And you have to bring sanity to the teaching and learning of mathematics. And that is what the team befriending mathematics is trying to do. When you talk about simple three-dimensional things, Students are at sea. They just try to imagine. But when you bring this figure to the classroom, the students now have an idea of what you mean by length, breadth, and height. And they can do their simple calculation. So mathematics becomes beautiful and it becomes fun. And students are getting better at it. And that by implication means all they do after secondary school become meaningful. Our approach is a very simple one. It is called spatalum. It simply means simple practical approach to the teaching and learning of mathematics. Here, for instance, is the simple cuboid three-dimensional. We can dismantle, we can break it into two. Then we have each side a right angle triangular prism. The right angle triangular prism can be broken down into its net and the students have a full day drawing and enjoying. In fact, if they like, they can break the net again to triangle to rectangle, 
and so on and so forth. You know, I've been to many countries in the world, and I've been into some classrooms outside Nigeria. I was in some classrooms in England. I was in some in US. I never saw mathematics made simple like this. Some had some wooden frames to show, but I didn't see anything like this. So easy, so straightforward. The students can play and enjoy mathematics. My name is Taiwo Oluwa Sonya. I am the brand and concept director of Befriending Mathematics. I have a BSc in mathematics and postgraduate diploma in teacher education. I just want to tell us some things we also do in the mathematics lab. Mathematics is fun. Most people are so scared of mathematics, but these are some of the things we can do in the lab. It is good to also let students know that they can actually play in the mathematics lab and feel free with shapes. It's not always 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. But I want us to know that 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. This problem, when solved, will be simple. How do we arrive at the 2 and the 2 to make 4? We have simple shapes here. This shape is a cube. And most of us know that cubes are made up of 6 squares of the same dimension. Here we have what we call a tricycle. It's made up of a cuboid, which has been explained. But we just added tires. This is a cuboid. Just put one tire here. We add another tire here. We had one more tire here. And you have this and it becomes interesting to the child. And they all look forward to coming to the mathematics laboratory. We can also build more. We have this, which is a right angle triangular prism. We could also add tires to it and we'll keep it moving. And we have these tires which are also circles. You let the child know that these are circles. They're different colors. This is purple, this is blue, and they all identify. And now we have a right angle triangular prism. It now becomes a vehicle and it's there. And it helps the child. He can play. Even right from playgroup to any class, they can feel free. The essence of this is to be familiar with mathematics. When you now go ahead and bring other more difficult or higher things, they're ready to learn and they become creative. Math is beautiful. You don't have to take canes. You don't have to force them. By seeing these things and playing with them, they all fall in love with maths. And when you say it is time for mathematics class, the child looks forward to coming to the class. And this will reduce mass failure in mathematics. Because the main aim of befriending mathematics, we have zero tolerance for failure in mathematics. Thank you very much. The topic we want to treat today using what we have locally is called Garimatics. Garimatics is a topic that makes teaching and learning of basic concepts and principles in mathematics very easy. Uh, it's a two word that comes from Gari, which we can get locally, and mathematics. So when you remove the Mati, you put the Gari and it becomes Garimatics. And what we intend to do is to show the students how they can get the relationship between cones and cylinders. And so what they will be doing now is to pour this gari that is there into this cone. And you pour it into the cylinder. And that is one cone. How many cones do we have now? One. One. Okay. We're doing it the second time. Two cones. Yeah. Okay. So, all right. Add it into that one. Yes. How many do you have? So, how many cones of Gary will you have in a cylinder of the same height and the same base? Okay, so we have three cones now. All right, so what it means is that a cone is a third of the volume of uh, the cylinder of the same base area and the same height. Now, Mrs. Amzat MS from Loyola College. I'm the HOD Mathematics. 
and Vice Principal Special Duties. I've been on this teaching profession in the last 24 years. I've attended seminars and workshops. But the instructors, they used to teach us abstractly. But in this last seminar, called Befriending Mathematics, we were taught how to use teaching aids in teaching the subject. We have concrete objects. We were not taught abstractly. We were taught in such a way that we'll be able to teach the students effectively. The teaching aids were as the teaching and learning process. The students will be able to understand different topics. With the help of the teaching aid, we have different types. We have, you can see keyboard, cube, we have pyramid, we have frostrum. There is teaching aid for teaching longitude and latitude, which the student think is very difficult. But with the help of this teaching aid, we'll be able to explain to them what longitude and latitude means, and they will be able to, to see it physically. We are teaching triangles. Using songs. Teaching triangles using songs. Now can we sing together? We are the six members of Triangle Family. We are the six members of Triangle Family. And so we are very proud. We are very proud to be called Triangles. La, 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 la. We are very proud. And so we are very proud, we are very proud to be called triangles. Oh, arise, triangles.